Hey, welcome to UK Wildcraft. So this is Wood Avens, GM Urbanum, also known as Herb Bennett. It's a very common herb and you'll find it in shaded woodlands and hedgerows and it grows all year round. There are two main uses for Wood Avens. You can eat the, the leaves and you can also eat the roots. So the leaves just can be added into salads. They don't have a particularly strong flavour. Uh, they can be used as an anti-inflammatory. Another good use for them is you can rub them onto insect bites and stings and it will take the sting away. The best use for the plant though are the roots. Now, of course you do need uh, permission from the landowner to dig up roots but these are very very common and they are much classed as a weed so I'm sure it won't be a problem to get permission and also the, there's a good chance that you'll find them growing in the garden as well. So you usually find a thicker root and then lots of trailing roots coming off of it. Now these roots taste exactly like clove, the herb clove. And they can be used in similar ways as well. And they, they even contain the same chemical as clove, which is eugenol. And that is a, uh, it helps numb tooth pain. So if you get tooth pain, you can dig up this root and you can either chew it to release the chemicals to help numb tooth pain or you can you can add it into olive oil and uh, make a similar to clove oil and just apply that to the tooth with like a cotton swab and that will help tooth pain. So to identify wood avens, first of all the leaves on first look they can look a bit like strawberry leaves and they are related to strawberry, they're both from the rose family. They have the three leaves in a lobe and those leaves are serrated. The difference is though with wood avens you get smaller leaves going back along the stem like that and you'll often get pairs of leaves on the main stem as well. In the summer you'll get the flowers, this is the, the last one that I could find here, they're yellow and they normally have five petals, although he's lost two. And now in July you'll get the seeds and you'll see there they're burrs and you'll often get these attached to your clothing if you're out for a walk in the woodlands.